We're also continuing to follow the search going on right now and the waters off of Carteret County where that plane disappeared from radar Sunday afternoon with eight people on board. Three sites of uh, crash debris have been identified. Four of those people on board believed to be teenagers who attended East Carteret High School. The group was said to be returning from a duck hunting trip when that plane disappeared from radar. Carteret County Sheriff Asa Buck says the body of one person has been recovered so far, but he is not releasing that name at this time. Rescue crews from the Coast Guard in Carteret County continuing their search for clues off the coast in the core sound. Rescue crews from the Coast Guard in Carteret County again searching that area. News Channel 12's Sharon Danqua is on the scene for us again today. Sharon, we're waiting for some amount announcements anytime now from the Carteret County Sheriff. What's the latest you're learning here this morning? Brian, crews are now out there searching the waters again. They've been searching on Sunday, Monday, and now they'll spend the rest of today searching. Now, I reached out to Coast Guard officials, and they say, as you said, in a couple of hours, we should hear some updated information from them, and we'll keep you guys updated throughout the day. But as of now, crews are out there. Um, Coast Guard officials also say they will be focusing on some crews in the skies, looking for those three debris fields. Also, just searching for anything they can find right now. As we said, um, this is taking place about four miles out from Drum Inlet, so they'll be searching the waters and in a couple of hours we should hear some updated information on what they have found and where they're at in their investigation. So far live in Down East, Sharon Dankwa for News Channel 12.